Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome back to Dutchman Plays Mahjong Soul. First things first, I asked, you guys answered. And so, uh, for everyone's sake, we have set the tile faces back to normal. And I got no problem doing that. That's just going to make everything easier for everyone to see. It's kind of like, um... If you ever had a deck of, like, anime cards, where all the playing cards have full art on every single face, and then you try to play, like, just a simple game of poker, everyone's got to stop and look at every single card to try and find out what the hell the number is, because they don't look like the normal suits and the normal numbers. Yeah, it's like that. So we set it back to normal. Uh, normal tile faces, everyone can read again. And we're just jumping right into a four-player south game. We're getting right back into the swing of things. Got some good tiles to start. Three, five, seven. There's a nice double inside weight. Pair of ones, pair of nines. Uh, the nine's useless. The one, two is probably our weakest shape. It only accepts the three of dots. We do have too many pairs, though, so our hand's going to be pretty inefficient anyways. Call this a 1-3 and then a 5-7, maybe. Making the 9s the pair. And then you pair the 5s immediately afterwards as well. Uh, 7 pairs. 1, 2, 3, 4 is possible. I think I can drop the 7 to play that way. I don't want to, but if it happens, then we'll take it. And it lets us use the Dora, the 8, even though we already discarded the 9. Red Dragon, yeet. More likely than not, we're probably just gonna dip out of this hand. Uh, let the other players play. We'll keep some safe tiles. Ones and nines are gonna be pretty safe, I think. The four makes a sequence. Let's drop the ones right away. Looking for six of bamboo, three of dots. And I'm probably gonna drop my one first. Immediate East is kinda spooky. Whites are guaranteed safe. One, two, three around the board. Nine of Dots is now safe as well, so we'll drop these. And maybe our two? Nope, just the nines. A fairly cheap hand, relatively speaking. But it could have been nasty. And our hand was just so far from being finished. It only made sense to step out of the way, play it fully safe, throw the hand away. Uh one one two two four five seven seven. A pair in the eights as well. You got a floating eight of dots, two of characters. That's perfect. We got three of a kind on the twos. Looking for a three, six, and the four, five. Drop the two because it's the furthest from any of our blocks. One, two, three, four, five blocks. So we're looking for seven or eight here. Dora is the north wind which we don't have any of, and it's not our seat wind, so it'd be hard to use it anyways. Except as a pair, uh, which we've already got plenty of, so we don't need to muddy our hand trying to work that in. And now, now we have some interesting choices. We could very easily go for Toy Toy, which is all pawns. Everything in our hand is a three of a kind. Steal the sevens, steal the fives, steal the ones, steal the eights. And after two calls, we are Tempai, one tile away. I think that's worth fighting for, especially since we've got the red five already. Uh, we got some awkward blocks to work with, though. We're not likely to see the sevens come out. The ones will come out pretty quick, I think, and we might see the eights as well. But we're playing against uh, open greens. Let's start calling. Uh, this four has got to go. This is our hottest tile. It's right in the center. 
It's an inside tile, so it's easy to use. Perfect. Uh, we'll double down on the four. This four of characters is going to be safe to the right, which I think is our uh, primary competition at the moment. Open Tanyao, all simples to the left, might be worth worrying about. But they might not even have a value yet. Uh, that's our second and last poem. We are ready to go. Looking for sevens and eights. Toy Toy has a value of two. All Pones has a value of two. Uh, we've got one red, brings it to three. We're not dealer, so it's one, two, thirty-nine hundred points. Oh, they're getting close. They're dancing around it. I I would bet a seven would come out from the left. They dropped all the nines, the sixes, and the eights. Ah, not fast enough though. Great hand. That's a Chanta. That's half outside hand. They have terminal sequences and a honor pwn. Or a parry even would work for that hand. Oh, that's a great start. We got a pair of the reds. We can open that up for Yakuhai, which is a value pwn. Anybody can use the dragons. Uh, the souths probably won't come together. Two easts are already out, so we're not likely to get that either. We need a pair to compensate for losing a pair. And uh, one of characters looks pretty good. Six and nine also fine, especially dropping the six waiting on the nine. We could even hang on to this self forever, but that I think is just gonna slow us down. One, two, three, four blocks, and then we need a pair. So drop the one, drop the six, waiting on the nine. Five might do something, so we'll hang on to it over a lonely south. And I haven't mentioned it yet, but we do have a seven of bamboo, which is the door. Brings our value to two at the least. We're making roads on the uh, characters over there. I don't think it's very likely that we get that. The full straight. But it would be interesting if we did. It would also mean we don't have to steal the reds. If we did. Get a 7, get a 4, get a 3. And then the reds can be the pair. Dropping 9, dropping 5. But if we don't want to go for that, and indeed we don't anymore. Um, drop the five right away. Lots of twos and eights. So the five's probably safe. I think the nine's gonna be a nice sneaky pair weight. And then we'll probably just look to drop the eight and nine, I think is our most inefficient shape. because it takes away from our 5-6. If we draw a 7 here, we still need a 4-7. But if we draw the 3, then we have a 4-7. And all the 4s and 7s are still alive. All right, play safe. Bamboos. My reds are honestly the safest tile I've got. Let's go ahead and throw. We'll find something else. It's a very close game. So a big roan on the first go around would give them a potsu, give them an extra value for free. There's no reason to risk that. Also, we drew the four, so the full straight is still alive. We need a three and a seven, and we'd have to drop a two, a five, and a nine. Not likely. Um. 
Yeah, we'll just play super safe. Drop the four, drop the two, drop the one, drop the four. I almost reflex dropped that too. That was almost very scary. It entered my hand and my first instinct was, oh, I don't need that. And I like reached to throw it away. And I was like, wait, wait, wait. No. <laughs> We're holding on to that tile for a very specific reason. I think it goes to the left here. They dropped one, two, nine in bamboo. All the characters, like, top to bottom. The only dots they've discarded are ones and nines. Yep, threes and fives. Oh, double pair weight. So it's very sneaky. If anyone had played a dot out, it wouldn't have been able to uh, read the Suji off of it. All right, seven, eight, nine, pair of sixes, three, four. The one is lonely, five, six. All right, the one is useful. Drop that nine. One, two, three, four, six, six, seven, eight, nine. I'd love to get a five here, and then we can open our hand. I'm gonna drop the three. There's also, see, that's an interesting chi. That's a one, two, three. That only works in outside hands, or they might have a um, a yakuhai, a dragon pwn. Probably not their seat wind, the west. Probably not the green dragons. Maybe a pair of reds or whites. Something like that. Maybe a misclick. Who knows? Whites? No. So I'm thinking red dragons or east wind. Uh, probably not a half flush. They dropped a 6-7 in the suit that they've opened on. And there's a Ricci. Fast Ricci on 4-7. Yes. I'll take that. There's a 7 here. The 8s are pwned. So I think this is a pretty, pretty good weight. Pretty likely to see this tile. 1-2-3 is pulled out of the game, so 4s are hard to use as well. The reds? No. So they must have east winds over here. I don't know what else they could be going for. There's the five, but we need the four and the seven. The only way we could have improved this hand, well, that sucks. Uh, I was about to say the only way we could have improved this hand by waiting on the Ricci would be if we could have drawn another six, we could have discarded the nine and gone for Tanya, which is all simples. The sixes would stay the pair, we'd have a six, seven, eight, and the nine is our last terminal. No matter whether we got the four or the seven, would have given us all simples. But we've got Richie Dora one. There's a chance for Ura. We have a pretty good weight because the tiles are hard to use. So I think we're in a good spot with this hand. Even without the one extra Han. It wasn't East either. I don't know what this guy's value is. I have no idea how he can win this hand. I don't know if he knows how he can win the hand. Do you see that hesitation? There, we just draw the sumo seven ourselves. Uh, so reach sumo door one. Tenfu, I forgot. Uh, only sequences. With an open-ended weight. Puts us above 30. Puts us in first place. We're happy as the clam. Ooh! 567 on a platter. Look at that. So that's a hand called Sanshoku. Uh, three suit sequences. I can't steal the white so to make it happen. And I need another block as well. Four, five, six is... Funnily enough, exactly what the doctor ordered. Five, six, seven, five, six, seven on this one. Then you have a four, five left over looking for three and six. 
I can steal a seven from the left. I had another five. I didn't need it. The double fives would have let me open on the whites, though. Also, sells for Dora, but who cares? This hand is beautiful. And there's a seven. Oh, man. Easiest Richie of my life. Let's go. Five, six, seven, five, six, seven, five, six, seven. The whites are a pair, so we're actually not going to get Pinfu for this hand because a pair of honors gives you Fu. And the rules for Pinfu are to have zero Fu. So we're not going to get the only sequences no Fu hand, even though we have an open-ended weight. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Magic. Unbelievable luck on that one. Mixed triple sequences, that's the Sanshoku. I call it three suit sequences, I don't know how else to describe it. Dealer Hanemon on a sumo, 18,000 points. We are unstoppable at this point. We'd have to throw hard to get uh, even second. There are sevens, pair of twos, three, four, six, seven, eight, with a five on the six. Yikes. Oh, so fast. We've got all of our blocks. We're just looking for the tiles now. Yeah, let's open. Tanya, all simples. Pair of the twos, looking for a two five and a four seven. And we're ready to go out again. There it is. Turn five of the game, we're ready to go out on all simples. Tanya, looking for a four seven in the characters. Turn off our calls because we don't need them anymore. We don't want to give any information to our friends here. Three we don't need. We're looking for four, seven in the characters. There's one four over there. Seven tiles in the wall. We don't need the three either. Oh, and we have one of the sevens. So that's why there's only six tiles. That's a scary hand over there. There's a hand... Oh man, I don't know if I have the name of it right. I believe it's... Chinroto is pawns of terminals only? No, that's the Yakuman. And we still have the seven anyways, we don't have to worry about it. Chinroto and Suiso are the two Yakumans. Onroto is the um, very valuable mixed pones of terminals and honors. So I was worried about the hand over there because pones of all ones is a Sanshoku. You can have. Um, the same pwn in each of the three suits, and that's also called Sanshoku. Um, I'm gonna throw the west right away. Alright, it goes past. Uh, fast reds across the way. I think we're gonna just let this one pass. We'll throw our hand away, we'll play safe, and we'll just let the dealership move around the table. And something I, I just thought about. If I'm gonna throw the hand, I probably should have held on to that Dora so that no one else could get it. If we do get roamed, we're not gonna get hit for that much value. But it passed anyways, so... Potato, potato. Probably thinking a bit too hard with considerations like that. And we've somehow managed to make a hand regardless. Uh, 567, 567 is Ipeko, double sequences. It 
it it's just i'm not gonna do the reachy because i don't want to get locked in i still want to be able to bail on this hand if i have to but if anybody drops the two of characters again which there's only two left in the wall uh then we're gonna get to roam them alternatively if we draw anything like four or five or seven in characters then we'll be able to upgrade our weight into a double-sided We'll increase our value by one, and we'll have a safe one of characters to discard. So we're just keeping an eye out on the tiles, making sure nothing dangerous is going on. There we go, that's a seven. Upgrades us to two, five, eight. Oh, I think I'm gonna go for it. I just said I wasn't gonna lock my hand in, but that is a lot of value. If Heiko is one, Richie is two, the Pinfu is three, Dora makes it four. This is another dealer manga at minimum. And it's a three-sided weight, two fives and eights. Just sumo, just sumo. That's how you play. I don't, did I mention the Tanya, the all simples? Hanemon, another 18k. Unbelievable. Woof. I gotta go buy a lottery ticket after this one. Holy guacamole. I'm gonna find a four leaf clover in the grass. There's gonna be a rainbow with a pot of gold at the end of it. Everything's coming up Millhouse tonight. Uh, this hand's a not quite as lucky as the others. 4-6-6, six, six, a pair of 8s, 4-4-5-6, four, four, so it's got a lonely 4 just kind of hanging out. The 1 does nothing, the 6 is all alone. The 6 is stronger than the 1. And I'm still going to keep that whole block together. Even though this is three of a kind, we might draw the five, and it gives me a four, five, six, and a pair. Four's got pwn, but that doesn't hurt our hand. I'm gonna drop the four here. So this got locked in as a four, five, six. I think I've got options for pairs elsewhere, so I don't need that lonely four. All right, and we got Tempai somehow. I don't want to go reach on this hand because I think the inside weight is garbage. But just like before, if we get... Um, if we can draw a 7 or a 5... Well, if we draw the 5, we just sumo and go out. As long as your hand is completely closed, you can always uh, self-draw the tile yourself, and it gives you the Yaku of sumo. Value of one. Probably half flush to the right here, so we need to be careful about these bamboo, but... I'm not worried about a nine. If I draw a seven on the six here, I can drop the one and take a double-sided weight. But I don't think there's any reason for me to go reach you here. Against the uh, scary hands to the right. I can drop one and six, and we'll turn this into a uh, double-sided dot weight. Because now we've got three, six, and four, seven acceptance. Unfortunately, we're Furriton on the four. I've dropped one earlier, so we're kind of screwed on that front. Sevens are kind of out there as well. Hmm. If I can chi a four. Now, see, that that works. Are we going to push it? Let's push it. All right, the five goes through. We're tempi once again on only the sixes, which there's one tile left in the game. But we're safe, so... 
You know, what are you gonna do? Uh, that's not happening. <laughs> Absolutely not. I will throw every hand away to keep that safe. You're probably gonna see three eights in a row in a second. Protecting that bad boy. I think the eights are the safest dot I have. I was right. It looks scary over there. I think they're waiting on a dot. I just don't know which one. If it's not eights and it's not threes and sixes, then it must be ones and fours. But the ones and fours are terrible. Four of characters. How did you make that work? Wow. And surprisingly, the reds would have been safe against them. No, they wouldn't have been. It's a red 7-4 weight. Yo, that's sneaky as F. That's nuts. What a dirty, dirty dog. I'm going to show you guys is that weight. The red was not safe. That guy is very clever. Bring that log up. Hit that view. Luckily, it was the last hand of the game. This guy had such bad luck, he got knocked out. Um, From their perspective. Alright, so they got the pair. We're going to bring it to, like, almost the last turn. So, five, six, seven. Well, look at it first, right? This is my pair. This is a pwn, three of a kind. So, I'm looking for fours and sevens in the characters, right? But, five, six, seven is a sequence which leaves behind a pair of sevens and a pair of reds. So this is also a double pwn weight. Sevens, reds, and four of characters are dangerous here. And I had the lonely red. This guy was waiting on the red dragon as anticipated. Half flush in the bamboo, waiting on the red. A dirty, dirty dog. We would have gotten double roamed if we had ever discarded that. And I believe we were in trouble as soon as we drew it. Swap back to our perspective. Red comes in our hand. Both of these players are ready for it. Wait. They need a tile over here. We would have only gotten hit by Honitsu door to south. Uh, this would have been possibly a Hanemon back. That would have kept this player in the game if we had discarded this. Uh, but we made the right move. We did not discard it. Still not Tenpai over here yet. The two comes out, immediate Richie on the three-sided weight for the red dragon. Now it's double Roan. And uh, I think four of characters comes out on the right here. Yep. There's no way he's, he's going to throw this hand away. This is so much value. He just gets hit by the second biggest hand at the table. Maybe the first biggest hand. This guy had a lot of red, red tiles as well. <sighs> Fantastic. What a, what a hand. And there was two tiles left. All I needed was one more draw to survive. Anyways, that's going to be it for this episode. Thanks everyone for watching. I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. If you did, please click the like and subscribe button. It really helps small channels like this one grow and reach a wider audience. And I hope you have a good morning, a good afternoon, a good evening. Goodbye.